Now the LOD module is uh, something completely new, it wasn't uh, in the previous version. It is directly linked to the layers, as you can see I have the same layers. And uh, but it allows you to work more intuitively, just like you did in Oxygen 2, for example. Double clicking on a lot will hide everything else and just make sure just a lot that you're working on is visible. That will uh, make sure you're working on the right one uh, without forgetting anything. Um, there are a few tools here, like adding lots, editing the names of lots, duplicating lots could be handy. Uh, deleting them and make sure you refresh it. Um, so what I'm going to do now is I'm going to create a few more lots and I'm going to do that uh, by duplicating this one. So I'm going to make lot one and duplicate it again. Lot three and say lot or something. This is just to show an example. Um, I'm also going to create a new lot. As you can see here, you have a few presets which are named, uh, which have the same names as the ones in the O2. Uh, let's see, I want to have a shadow volume zero. Okay, now I have all the memory has been uh, created by default when the plugin was run. So let's see. Now I'm in lot 10, which is this one. Um, lot 0. And it will stay the same as it is. Lot 1. Let's see. I'm going to delete some parts. Ideally, of course, you will want to not just delete parts, but uh, create whole new models for different lots or do some kind of mesh reduction to make sure you're really reducing your polygons. Okay, now that's one, that's lot three. Uh, let's see, in lot three, we're gonna so remove this, 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 this. Some shitty polygons here, I find out. Okay. And again, this. Say, so I'll remove that. And now, you see, in lot 10, I'm still have, I still have a copy of lot 0. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete lot 10. And I'm going to duplicate lot 3 to be lot 10. Okay. No 10, and here we're going to again delete some parts. Oops. To make sure I have them in a I'll just demonstrate that it will be different when you export it. Um, shadow volume empty. Ideally, you want to create a nice low poly shadow. For your model, well, what I'm going to do again is I'm going to delete this and I'm going to duplicate lot 3 to uh, actually lot 1 to be the shadow. Shadow 0. So lot 3 is now shadow. Um, if I want, I can turn lot 10 to be anything else, whatever, and you can have as many of course as you want. In the end all of them will be exported to O2 without any problems. Just make sure you have unique names uh, and if you use the presets then it will be much easier uh, exporting as I'll show you later. And that's it, that's my lot setup. Now it's time to create some memory lots.